Every week, there are tons of plays that show the speed, strength, and athleticism of the players in the NFL. And it's amazing to watch. But you won't see any of that here. Nope, we're showcasing the top three plays that leave you scratching your head. Welcome to What the Football. Number three, you may not want to ask Browns DB Johnson Batamosi for directions. Yeah, no, ball's loose. I don't want to know what is going on at the bottom of that pile. But Batamosi's pretty darn ecstatic right now, thinking the Browns have recovered the ball. He enthusiastically points to let the fans know who has possession. However, yeah, that would be the wrong direction. A couple of problems here. Not only was it the wrong direction, turns out he was also wrong about which team recovered the ball. WTF, bro. And number two, it's one of the most exciting plays in football, the punt return. And look at Danny Amendola take it all the way across the field, juking defenders, using his blockers, and then bursting down the sideline with no Giants in sight. Breaks another tackle. I do not see a flag. This is going to be his first career punt return for a touchdown. Oh, man. Oh, his own teammate tripping him up, Deron Harmon. That is inexcusable. What the football? At number one, the Ravens just seconds away from getting their third win of the season, but then Elvis Doomerville comes into play and sends the Ravens back to Heartbreak Hotel. Watch this while sacking Blake Bortles. He grabs the face mask. What the football, Elvis? The 15-yard penalty allowed the Jags to kick this game-winning field goal, leaving the Ravens all shook up. Meanwhile, all Jacksonville could say after the reversal of fortune was, thank you, thank you very much. Jacksonville with a miraculous road win in Baltimore. Well, that is it for this week's plays. Did you see something that we may have missed on WTF? If so, let us know by tweeting with the hashtag, WhatTheFootball.